Hello there, fellows, and welcome back to the Play Minecraft server. I figured that, seeing as I have some time to record right now, and I haven't put out an episode of Tiger Tactics in a while, I might as well. I think I'm going to do it a little bit differently. I'm going to record um, a game of survival games, and probably this one. But um, I'll record a game of survival games, and I'll voice over it. So I'll record for a while, and then um, after I'm done recording, I'll do a voiceover and make a separate recording just for um, what I want to say. Because, recently, there's some big news. This Monday, Mojang was completely bought out by Microsoft. And so I'm going to be talking a lot about that. Please forgive me if I'm horrible at survival games, because I've only played this like twice before. But it looks like it's going to start, and... Yeah. We'll see what it's like. Alrighty, um, just a quick note before we begin, I'm gonna say I did play quite a bit of survival games, and from that I've determined I'm not that good. Um, quite a few times I died like the second or third person to die, so these videos are going to be sped up versions of my two... I think they're my best games. I got pretty close in both of them. I'm just not a very good fighter under pressure, I suppose. But, anyway, on to the topic at hand. Microsoft has bought Minecraft. Um, a lot of you are probably wondering just what that means. My, my, not only did they buy Minecraft, they also bought Mojang the actual company that runs Minecraft. So instead of now being an indie game, it's run by a large company. Um, mixed feelings on that. I don't really care either way. I'm just worried about Microsoft handling the community of Minecraft badly. You think about it, they're a big company, they're not used to having so many people actually, like, looking to their game at such a time. Minecraft is honestly the biggest game in the world right now. And so there are a lot of people who are wondering what's coming next. Obviously, Microsoft isn't completely and totally stupid. They're not going to change anything really, really quickly. That would be a horrible idea. They're going to try and build up ties with the community um, and try not to take their game away. Just do anything completely and totally wrong. Mind you, they are there to get money. And so they might start some sort of a monetization system on possibly YouTube ads. They, they might ask for a cut of all YouTube ads on videos relating to Minecraft. That's something that Mojang said that they would never do. But if Microsoft wants to, they can, because, yeah it would make YouTube a lot less of a Minecraft thing because full-time YouTubers you would need well over a million subscribers to get any sort of a pay out of doing YouTube which makes me kinda happy because I I don't care I'm not in it for the money I'm doing this in my free time and so you guys can keep on expecting Minecraft videos there that's it. Um, if Microsoft decides to do something that would mess with the game, such as releasing 
Minecraft 2.0 and not developing Minecraft 1.0 anymore, then we then I might have to switch to a different game. Just to be completely honest, um, Minecraft it's it's theorized right now Minecraft 2.0 would be an Xbox One only game and I do not have an Xbox One. I do not have the capability of recording on an Xbox One. I don't even really know what an Xbox One is. So yeah, that makes that kind of difficult. Um, I do hope that Microsoft doesn't try to do that anytime soon. My personal opinion is that at least we've got a year before they make any big decision. Um, It'll take a month or two before Microsoft actually takes over Mojang, um, but it it's still kind of a iffy time. Um, so yeah, I can tell you if Minecraft were to stop being the game that it is then there would be a lot of people who would not be happy. Which is most likely why Microsoft will not try to do anything like that. They want to keep the people happy so that they can keep on making money and doing stuff like this. Um, as it stands, right now, we really don't have much we can do about it and we really yeah we we can't do anything about the fact that Microsoft bought Mojang we cannot do anything about it um, but they're not going to be able to do anything for another month or two so my recommendation would be to just keep on playing Nothing has changed right now, and Minecraft is still a fun game. Um, yeah. That being said... I think that... When Microsoft does start to develop Minecraft, they're going to... Um, make it a far more optimized game. They are going to make it a lot more compatible, but... and just generally make it work better. In case you didn't know, Minecraft is a very glitchy game as of now. If you start up a clock, the game will suffer. <laughs> like, your computer can't handle a simple torch clock that's running all the time. It's noticeable. There are glitches like that, there's glitches in the render engine, you can do weird stuff, and if they, if Microsoft is developing Minecraft, that stuff is probably not gonna happen. So, if anything, that's something to look forward to. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all I really wanted to cover. Um, just post down in the comments, tell me what you think. Microsoft has bought Mojang. What are they gonna do? Please notice, all of this was really just my opinion, and so it's not the way things are. You can look it up for yourself. I've, I'll put down a few links in the description, one of them to Microsoft's statement on the fact, and one of them to Mojang's statement on the fact. You can read some of the original stuff yourself. Um, so, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you've enjoyed. I am definitely not a star survival game player yet, but I might post some more videos on it. Tell me what you think. And until next time, fellows, so long.